So today we're going to talk about a new feature in the LI4278 with the Rev-B firmware, which is due to come out shortly. Um, the LI4278 from Motorola is a cordless Bluetooth scanner. Uh, it's a linear imager. And what we're going to show today is connecting to an Apple iPad and toggling the virtual keyboard, um, as well as uh, uh, not requiring a authentication pin code. So. Basically, uh, all I do is go to the setup, turn the Bluetooth on, uh, it automatically goes out and scans the area for communicating devices. In this case, the top one here happens to be this particular scanner, we can tell by the serial number. And to connect it, all I have to do is tap on the connection button. Um, since this has Bluetooth 2.1 uh, communication stack built into it, um, it uses what's called the SPP, or the Simple Pairing Protocol, to communicate and uh, do a low-level authentication. So that doesn't require a PIN code to be scanned into the device and cause the authentication between the scanner and the iPad. Um, so that's automatically handled by the communications protocol. Um, the other thing that I wanted to show today is uh, we have a nifty little feature we're adding to RevB. And what that allows us to do is to toggle the virtual keypad by pressing the trigger twice in succession, like that. So simply by aiming the scanner anywhere and pressing the trigger, I can make the keyboard appear and disappear. So this is helpful as people are scanning products in their application and they want to go and enter some data, they can simply press the, the trigger twice and enter a quantity, for example, or whatever the case may be. Um, you can go back to scanning right after that. You don't have to toggle back out if it's more convenient or if the application